Uh, this question uh, we need to look at uh, place value in numbers and rounding. Um, so write the number 3,109 in figures. So place value talks about thousands, hundreds, tens, units, uh, tens of thousands and so forth. Decimal points, tenths, hundreds. So we really need to know our place values for numbers and how we uh, think of them. So we're asked for 300, uh, sorry, 3,109. So we've got 3,000, 100, no tens, and 9. So 3,109. Now the next part of the question is asking us to think about the value of the 6 in the number 23.469. So we've got 23.469. Well again, if we think about the way place value works, this is in the tens column, then the units. So after the decimal points, we're going into the decimal fractions, so tenths one hundredths, thousandths. So they're asking for the six and that's in the hundredths column. It's asking for the value of the six. So be careful that you don't just put down here hundredths as such. We really ought to be putting down what the value of that is. So it's six hundredths. The question here is asking you to round to the nearest hundred. So again when we look at the number, the hundredths column is here units of tens, hundreds. So we're talking about either 4,200 or 4,300. Well, we look at the next place value on and that's over the halfway to a next hundred up. So it's over 50. So we're going to go to 4,300 as the answer here. So place value, really important you remember the place value of all the digits and how the system works, particularly after the decimal point when we're talking about the decimal fractions tenths, hundredths, thousandths and remember to look for carefully what the question wanted it wanted the value of the six so that was six hundredths not just the word hundredths